We are getting everything set up for the live event. Uh, hold on. You kind of are. And the problem that we're having is that somebody's gonna be here to fix our plumbing because, well, it's backing, well, it hasn't quite backed up, but it's bubbling. And our Durango's overheating. That's the only vehicle we have left because our minivan's broken down. My motorcycle's not running. So, it's an interesting day. So Silas, what are you doing? I'm gonna actually put mealworms on my bagel and egg. I've never done this before. This would be a small spoon size. Yeah, that's fine. I saw the mealworms and I was like, ooh, I wanna try this on my bagel and egg, so. Sounds like a good idea to me. All right, there it is. How does it taste? Did you get mm. it in that bite? Mm hmm It's good. How does it taste different? They're really good. Um, they add a little bit of flavor. Thumbs I would up. recommend it. Yeah, definitely. What are you doing? In bugs. <laughs> looks like you're dropping bugs. <laughs> Careful. So you got them kind of like in the middle of your bagel? <laughs> Yeah! Wow, that's a big bite. Now they're gone. Can you taste them even? Or does it just taste like bagel? It just like bagel. So, thumbs up. Well, there is nothing like figuring out when you've got a Facebook Live happening and you figure out that your sewer line is backing up because of roots growing. Now this has happened before. This isn't the first time. It happened when we first got into the house. Had them come out, cut all the roots out. But heard this blue, 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 blue. We're gonna have to go to the in-laws house to get showers. Naomi, you ready? Let's go. Thank the Lord for family and you can run to their house. It's 12 o'clock. So much for lunch. We are getting ready for the live event, the fourth. We've got RNA on the line, kind of switch stuff up today because we've got plumbers working outside cleaning our drain. Well, hopefully cutting the roots out because we need something to happen. Something's in blood. You don't want to tell me what you're doing? I'm trying to get my motorcycle going because our truck is broke down and not sure if I'm going to need to go get more parts. So you got to fix one thing to fix the other? Hopefully. I'm not a mechanic, so. Where'd this bike come from? It's my dad's. It's one of the last things he did before he passed away, and this was his heart and soul. Everything on this bike was customized for his liking. So. <laughs> yeah. Seriously? Thank you. <laughs> Seriously. I might use words that I haven't used since I was 12. I'm just saying. Just saying. So, is this a technique you saw off YouTube? Naomi? Would you like to go back inside, please? <laughs> I just can't get this back. My camera's good. Why is it so freaking funny? I do so appreciate you. Oh, I'd appreciate it if we had vehicles that ran. The motorcycle was not the hero. Oh, uh, the, the battery that they sold me for the bike, this does not fit into the, ba the battery compartment. I'll be hiking it tomorrow to the store. Unless some miracle this thing get to the thermostat and replace it, and that's what it is. Hopefully that's what it is and not anything else. Otherwise this whole, this whole cabin's supposed to come out. I'm glad that you find it humorous, because I'm just trying to keep what my- What else can you do but laugh? I don't know. <laughs> Come on! But I got the truck back together, kind of what I took apart anyway, and it still seems to be doing its thing. So I'm not sure if it's a water pump, radiator, or whatever. Um, not sure what I'm gonna do next on that one. We've got a family member, and not your typical family member. They're they're friends. They're church friends. They're our, my brother, brother from another mother. Brother, <laughs> yes. So. He's act, they're actually loaning us their Suburban again tomorrow. This is the second time they've rescued us in our time of need. So thank you, Justin and Kim. Appreciate that. 
get a different battery switched out and change on the motorcycle. So we'll at least have some modes of transportation, hopefully tomorrow. Um, anyway, I want- On to something sweeter. Yeah, so what do we have here? You just tell me what we have here. Okay, well in my research, I found that there is lots of fruit options. Fruit's kind of a big deal in the Oceana world. And so, and they kept talking about ginger. So I know you love ginger. ginger. So we did some pineapple, some um, watermelon, some honeydew, and some, actually some oranges. And then I grated up a whole bunch of ginger yes. and mixed it in there. And so then we're gonna sprinkle some coconut on top as well. Um, I have not put that in there yet, but I think it should be a nice sweet treat for a long day. This season has definitely pressed us to the point even today where I'm just like, I wanna go back to making, you know, to a private sector, start making money. I can make, a, I made a lot of money in the past, but it's not about money. And it's about, it's about the reach. We're just, we're just talking about the 1%. Not the 1% of the wealthy. <laughs> although if you're watching, we could use your help. But we're talking about the 1% of the orphans. I mean, for me, yes, this, this a fig is for more than them, okay? So I don't wanna just constrict it to the 1% of the orphans, all right? But I will say that my heart is for the orphans. And the one, I just, I wanna, I, wanna, I wanna focus on 1%. Then we go to 10 and 20 and 30 and 100. Anyway, I dream big. But I do wanna look at just, just 1%. If we could just change the lives of 1.3 million children, how many world changers, how many doctors, how many, like, out of 1.3 million children? Man, it's worth it. All the headaches, all the frustrations, all of the not sure how this is gonna work is worth it. Look at that. Don't be jealous, you can make it too. I forgot something, I wanted to hit something. Where are you going? Like honestly, we're here recording and you're just getting up and leaving. You left the cabinet open. <laughs> yep. What me this time? This is our little symbol, yeah. our reminder on days that are a little bit tricky and you kind of freak out that there is good stuff yes. happening, fun stuff happening. We have fantastic friends who are willing to let us borrow their vehicle. Mm -hmm. They actually kind of need it themselves, mm -hmm. but they're gonna let us borrow it because we have no working vehicle <laughs> right now. And they actually were the kind people who gave us this simple yes. this reminder that this is an adventure mm -hmm. and that this is fun, meant to be fun. Sometimes there's ups, sometimes there's downs. And sometimes there's a freak out moment when you're on the way down and yeah. you don't know exactly what's gonna happen. When you can't see where you're going. Yeah. You lose control. Well, you think you do, kind of. But, but. in all reality, number one, I, we have vehicles. We have modes of transportation. And our plumbing got fixed today. Like at one point we thought it was gonna be Tuesday. Yeah. Like no showers, no toilets till Tuesday. That would be a huge bummer. Yeah, oh yeah. Big bummer. And, and even these little inconveniences, like literally, I was just, I will walk to the store. Yes, it's a you know couple miles away. Oh well, we're fine. Like I can walk to the store. We don't need, like literally. We are not in a position like many people around the world. We're healthy. Yes. I mean, all of us are are healthy. Mm -hmm. We have fantastic food that mm -hmm. we have easy access to, mm -hmm. and we can just enjoy it. Even with all this stuff, just so grateful for. Yeah, Who when you are. take a step back, sometimes in the midst, it feels a little tricky and mm -hmm. frustrating. But when you take a step back and you realize, no, actually, we're so blessed. Mm -hmm. And we have fantastic family. Mm -hmm. We have a great support network. And I feel like that's probably the thing that helps get us through the most. Is this it community. Is. Right. I mean, that's a big thing. Don't be alone. Find people around you. Lock arms with people around you. Makes everything a little smoother. A little does. bit nicer. It really does. And since we're giving shout outs, I do want to shout out to my parents who yes. Yes. totally made today happen for us. Don't focus on the negative. Always put what you're thankful for above everything else. 
it makes the journey a whole lot more fun with an attitude of gratitude. I'm getting ready to go edit. It's about 12, I don't know, 12 something night, so it's actually tomorrow. But I'm editing today, tomorrow. Anyway, I didn't get any insect, I don't think, on camera today. Well, you know what? There was some in the li maybe in the live because I was eating my mealworms and anyway, I got a handful, a handful of chopped onions. I actually got more I'm gonna eat. But I just figured, hey, you need to see somebody eating insects. Just like their popcorn. Hmm, popcorn. Mercy Makata, you did a great job. Thank you. See ya. Thank you.